What's up guys, welcome to the Macintosh Review. In this video, I'm gonna be discussing the iOS 10.0.3 software release that Apple revealed to the public today. I'm gonna to be discussing just what has changed in that release, and I'm gonna give you guys an outlook on the iOS 10 jailbreak, along with how you can install jailbreak apps on iOS 10.0.3 without jailbreaking. So let's jump right into it. So first off, iOS 10.0.3, if I open up my settings application here on my iPhone 7, you'll be able to see that it's a very minor update. Essentially what this update actually fixes is the loss of cellular connectivity. I actually have experienced this and this is actually exclusive to the iPhone 7 and iPhone 7 Plus. So if you do not have an iPhone 7 or a 7 Plus, you will not see this update available. That's because those users on the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus were the only ones affected by this issue. Essentially the cell phone service would drop randomly, you would lose internet, and I actually experienced this this past weekend before they released the update. Glad to see that they actually did release this update. If you were having those issues on an iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, they will now be fixed, and on the older devices, you no longer even have to worry about this because it will not affect you. First of all, that's the update. Real small update, but it is good that Apple pushed it out to us today. So many of you may be wondering, how does this affect the jailbreak status? Well, I haven't made a jailbreak status update video in a while, so I wanted to jump in with this video, just give you the brief status update. Essentially, this does not change the jailbreak at all, actually. iOS 10 currently does not actually have a jailbreak, and we did have iOS 10.0.2 before this. Really, the status remains the same. The Pangu jailbreak team, I still do expect them to release a jailbreak before the year is over, more likely when iOS 10.1 is revealed. I also expect the jailbreak to be similar to the Pangu jailbreak that we had for 9.3.3, where it will be through a computer as the Safari methods seem to be patched very easily. So I would expect expect that to be released by December. We know how hard the Pangu jailbreak team works. We saw how long it took them to release the 9.3.3 jailbreak. It really is a positive that they are getting these software updates to play around with, make sure they can find some vulnerabilities to release the jailbreak for us. And honestly, guys, there are some positives that come out of this. Although we may not be getting a new jailbreak until the year end, most likely, we do have some methods that you can install jailbreak applications without jailbreaking your device. I do have some links down there in the description. If you check out those videos, they will teach you how to install jailbreak apps on your device without jailbreaking. Some of them I have installed here. I have Tweakbox, IEMU Hub, Hacks for iOS, and Zestia. All of those applications allow you to download Cydia applications without jailbreaking your device, as you guys can see. Come right in here, you have tweaked apps, you have tweaked box apps. Many of these applications work the same way, and I do have guides for many of them down there in the description. So check out my videos down there to install jailbreak apps without jailbreaking. You won't actually have to hack your device. It works on iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. And hopefully that will keep us appeased until we have the full iOS 10 jailbreak. So in sum, iOS 10.0.3 does fix a cellular connectivity issue that many of us were having, including myself on the iPhone 7 and iPhone 7. 7 plus. The jailbreak should be released by year end or first quarter 2017. So we do have something to look forward to there. As always, guys, if you want to install jailbreak apps without jailbreaking, just to keep you appeased in the meantime, I do have links down there. So hopefully this video helped you out. Hopefully it was a good update. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to subscribe and rate thumbs up as well as stick around for more videos. I've also got my Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus, and website page down there in the description for you guys to check out. And also be sure to check out the links in the description to get paid iOS and Android apps 100% free. Really, really easy ways to do that and highly recommended. And anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. I will be back with more tutorials on how to install jailbreak apps, iOS videos, and iPhone 7 videos alike. So stay tuned for those guys. Stick around. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. Have a great day or a great night whenever you're watching this video and stay awesome, guys. I will catch you later. Peace.